BitApps has two lifetime deals that you can grab right now on AppSumo. That means that you'll be saving a bunch of money because you'll only have to pay once. Now, those links will be provided in the description. The two deals available from BitApps on AppSumo are BitForms and BitAssist. BitForms is obviously a form builder on WordPress, but you can also embed these. <coughs> But you can also embed these forms on other sites that are not WordPress. And same thing goes with BitAssist, which is a widget that you can embed on your website that lets you add, for example, a form, a knowledge base, videos, etc. And it's super easy to use. Plus, it's going to be super useful for your website. So let's go ahead and check out these deals right now. And then I'm going to show you how they actually work. So currently, you've got BitForms, which is on a lifetime deal that starts off at $79. And I think it's a fantastic deal because on Plan 2, which is $142, you get unlimited websites. So you can use these on your website, create as many forms as you want. You can embed these forms on other websites. So it gives it a lot of flexibility. Plus, you won't be limited on the amount of submissions, the amount of forms, because these are embedded on your WordPress website. Then the next one is Bid Assist, which starts off at $49 for the lifetime deal. And it gets you access to five websites, plus 21 channels and unlimited widgets and channels. Now, be aware that it says five websites and that's five WordPress websites, but you can embed this on other websites. So again, we got that flexibility to have this available in more websites than what it says there. OK, so let's go check this out. This is my WordPress website and I want to get started with BitAssist because I love this plugin because it's just super easy to set up and I know it's going to be super useful for the people who visit your website. And let me just show you really quickly how this is appearing on my website. I haven't changed the icon, but I've added a few things. So I'm going to click on it and I can have, for example, I've added a knowledge base and all I have to do is just add the question and the response. So in this case, what is an LTD? And I just said lifetime deal and boom, I have that available. Or how about watching a video? Let's click on YouTube. I and I added it just like that. Super easy. The same thing goes with WhatsApp. It'll take you to WhatsApp and they can contact you. And it's super easy to build. Okay. So in this case, let's get started by adding a new widget. Let's go ahead and name this number two, just for testing purposes. And the first thing you're going to see here is that you have the option to use on this side and an external site. So as I mentioned before, you can use these on other websites, even though you create them right here. So I'm getting started here and I can add the channels that I'm going to need. So for example, if I use Calendly, I can go ahead and select this, add the details to my booking page, and I can do it through the widget right here. Same thing goes, for example, for a knowledge base. All I have to do is add the question and the response right here. And it's just super easy and practical to create these. How about Instagram? For example, just go ahead and select it here, add the username, and they can click on it and it'll take them straight to Instagram. So the widget turns out to be super useful when you add these channels. So currently, these are the channels available. And if the channel is not there, you still have the option to use the custom iframe and the custom channel. So that means that if you have an iframe, for a different situation, let's say, just say that you're using a, another form builder, uh, some pop-up or whatever, just use iframe and you can start using it just in case the channel is not available yet. Frequently asked questions and so on and so forth. So it's super easy to create this and I like it because it has simplicity, plus it's super useful for the visitors. Then you've got your customization settings, the widget name, the widget style, the widget color. So right now it's green by default, but I can change this to match the branding on my site. The widget icon, I can use one of these or just upload my own. The widget position, you got your padding, widget size, widget shape, and you have custom CSS too. So you can highly, highly customize this if needed. Plus you can enable this on desktop and mobile or just desktop or just mobile. So maybe it's just too invasive on the mobile app. So you can turn this off and you can hide credit if needed. And then you got your settings. So you can enable business hours so it can be enabled at certain business hours, not all the time. And it's up to you if you want to enable that. Just go ahead and enable this, set the date and time here, and you are good to go. You can enable widget active batch if needed. Again, the page filter, and you have several available details here that you can customize. Then we got our external publish. So if you don't want to use it here on the WordPress website, like, I, like it says in the beginning, external website, just go ahead and copy this script and add it on the website that you want to use this for. So it's easy and practical, and you can create as many as you want right here because you are not limited. It's unlimited widgets and channels on this price. So for 44 bucks as of this video, you can add the... So for 40 bucks as of this video, you can create as many widgets as you want. 
then we got bitform okay so let's go into bitform i already have it installed here bitform pro and bitform is actually really powerful there's a ton of features available i've actually created a dedicated video for bitforms before so if you want to just check out every single detail there go ahead and check out that video i'll leave it in the description but let's go ahead and check out one of these forms let's go ahead and create one you have available form templates that you can get started with in this case there's templates available for different situations in this case i'm going to use for example the, the feedback which is really popular and it's highly used so for example i'm going to use this template and it loads up the basic elements for this form so in this case this is the feedback form i got the details like the name last name etc if i select any of these elements i'm going to view the settings on the right and yes there's a ton of settings because the way that bitforms develops is that they want to make it really powerful and highly customizable because other form builders just limit you on different situations so just selecting this element will give you all these available options that you can go through to set up the way you need it and same thing goes with any of the elements that you select and depending on the element that you select the details are going to change here on the right so you'll have different settings depending on what you select okay so for example if i select attachments i'm going to get different settings here for example i can set the attachment size for the file so it doesn't go over 50 megabytes or something like that i can set that up here by just selecting it and on the left we have all the available elements that we can drag inside of here so by just clicking on it it will get added right here and i just go ahead and select it and i have the details over here on the right to go ahead and customize it in this case it's a date timer there's a spacer and it just adds space here go ahead and select it i can modify the space i can drag the space in case i need it bigger and i can just click on the elements that i'm gonna need so for example a radio button a currency if i want to add a payment gateway i can do so here by adding paypal razor pay stripe mall molly uh, short code buttons it's, it's crazy all the things that you can add right here including html in case you want to add something that's external or a video or whatever you want to do via html now aside from all those features you got a step form that you can build so if it's just going to be a simple form you're good to go but if you want to add steps there's a little tab here on the right and it converts it into a step form and you can continue building the next part of the form and you can build several steps in case you want to make a feedback form that is that's in steps so you can do it this way by adding steps here on the top which is pretty easy to do so and again you got your settings for the multi-step settings available here by clicking on it by enabling or disabling features that you don't want to have in the step form okay then in the center tab over here in the entries we're going to view all the entries when people start filling out these forms so the cool thing about this is that you have advanced filters that you can start using you can export the details here so if you want to export these and send them over to an email marketing system that is possible here you got data view and edits view analytics reports and all that will be available right here then you got your settings and in settings again we got a bunch of settings and i know it can become overwhelming but i rather have all these available options than not having them but i mean all you have to do is just go through these settings follow through them just go ahead and read what they do and go ahead and enable or disable what you're going to need for example allow single entry for each ip address so if you don't want people filling the form out like crazy go ahead and enable this because it's going to be locked to the IP address. And it's just simple options here that you can go ahead and enable and disable depending on your needs. Then you got your confirmation message. You can go ahead and, and edit that message here, or you can do a redirect page. So just go ahead and take them out to a link when they finish the form. So if you want to send them out to a specific link on your website for a coupon code, etc., you can do it this way. Your conditional logic, again, conditional logic is highly advanced. It's pretty much straightforward. So you got your when something happens, do this action. So for example, if, let me go ahead and create a new one here, get an action, go ahead and select it. Here we go. So for example, if then, so if something happens, then do this. So I'm gonna say just for example, if the last name, and I'm gonna say contains, and I'm gonna say my last name, and this is just an example, then I can do something else. So for example, then the email will be disabled. Uh, just an idea, but you can do highly advanced conditional logic right here using the conditional logics. You got your email templates your integrations so currently they integrate with all these available apps as of this video so they keep adding more but right now these are available so a lot of options to integrate you got your form of abandonment if you want to enable this that means that if someone goes through half the way of the form then you still get that data so it's, it could be useful or not so it depends if you want to enable this or not you got your data view and edits 
conversational form, your landing form, PDF templates, a double opt-in option in case your country requires it for certain situations, and WP Auth for advanced connections. So several available settings for you on the form builder. So currently, like I said, these two lifetime deals are available at AppSumo and you can grab them right now. They are currently on a discount, but they, it could be gone in the future. So you'll get it at the original price of $49 instead of $44. And over here, the unlimited, unlimited version, which is $142, but it's going to be normally $158 for the lifetime deal for the unlimited websites. So right now, it's a great deal. Go ahead and grab it before it's gone. And they are currently running a lifetime deal bundle on their website in case you want to grab all the bit apps this is the way to go so go ahead and check this out and you can go ahead and grab them right now in the link in the description so don't miss out on this deal and grab them right now